Dominique, and I'm rocking out with Shot Town. 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 It's gonna be finished, man. Life okay. of Chronicle of Richie Rich. Probably. Life of Chronicle of Richie Rich. Yeah. Um, I asked you. I think I asked you last time. Why that? Why that title? Why did you do that title? You know, because through life you go like Chronicles. To me, it's like action. You know what I'm saying? Like it's a lot of actions in your life that you go through. And then I would just want to get a people a sense of what I done went through all my life because most of the most of the songs on there, it's it's real and like. Like it's a rocket bell up top of the rear. You know, I got a few other tracks. I got a, a track named after me, Richie Rich. You know, it's, it's a lot of stuff coming. You know what I'm saying? Really? Hundreds. You know, it's, 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 it's a lot. I'm, I'm coming. Okay, definitely. Anything you want to ask from everyone? I want to hear. Well, okay. I forgot what I was gonna say. Jesus. What? Why are you only one track away from completing? What? What was keeping you from just you know wrapping you, it up? You know, uh. Just personal thing, you know. But I had to get back on and get back focused to what's gonna be what I want to be my bread and money maker. You know, there's a lot of little issues going on. You know, time and stuff like that, and with getting with the right producers. You know, getting my stuff
I won't lame it out, I promise. Okay. That's fine. That's a lame it out. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Building connection and connecting dots. That's what I like. I like hearing stuff like that, man. Um, let me ask you this then. And and I know that in Chicago it, it's hard. Yeah. So once you make it, then could I see that you're you know, that you could, you know, go somewhere with it. Do you see yourself moving out of Chicago? No. At least moving to the suburbs? Probably so to the suburbs, you know, get my get my kids, you know, uh, a different view of life, you know, even though I do that anyway, you know. Right. I try to travel with them and stuff like that. But I, I try to get them a you know, a, a different different a- aspect of life, you know. So right. I move to like the suburbs. But I mean, I, I told them I still would tell them nothing still is easy. I yeah. think it was easy, you know. I wouldn't give them nothing or take, tell them to take anything for granted because I don't take anything for granted. Yeah. Okay. How old are you? 29. 29. Okay. Okay. And you say you would never, you know, okay. Never move out of Chicago? Ever? Uh, no. No? Okay. I, I mean, I, I, I like Chicago. It's a pretty good place, you know. It's just certain areas are bad, you know. Certain yeah. areas are, are, are Because like we speak on with poverty You know But like It's so many people To be honest What I think You know it, It's so many people That want to be You know what I'm saying Rappers and stuff like that That Sometimes they get in the image That Doing all the bad things Is good You know Like it's an image That they portray that, That's not really a good image You yeah, know yeah. So like they, they want to, you know, sell drugs. They think working a job is bad. You know, they think, how you know, they think the wrong thing. So, so, well, 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 let me ask you this then. Do you think people are, they're not learning that, like, cause when the first time I ever went downtown, I was 13. Yeah. Very, very first time. So do you think a lot of people, they only know those, those, those four blocks that they that they travel on, they never go outside of those those areas. And you think that that kind of minimizes people's perspectives on things? Uh, yes, uh, because uh, we were just having a conversation with one of our homies about this. Uh, he said he took one of his friends downtown, and he started crying because he never been outside of. Uh, the blocks wow. yeah. And it's right downtown So like Yeah So it's some people That never been downtown That, that That's you know So yeah. like It is They only know them Four blocks So you know It's hard for them You know They learning the wrong things In, yeah. in society you, you I mean I might rap about Stuff like that But You gotta learn Don't You learning the, You taking the things The wrong way yeah. You know You learning wrong so you gotta you gotta be able to you know you got, man it's just when you when you come I feel you, you know. trust me I do yeah all right well let's, I, I want to get into your track man let's talk about you're on top of the world man oh yeah like oh, Leonardo yeah. DiCaprio oh yeah most definitely so talk to us about top top of the world man top of the real is just that's a track where it's a track really made for when I do make it you know what I'm saying like and how I wanted to make it so bad when I was a shorty and what I started doing to make it and then how I started dreaming and then I now I feel like it can get me on top of the real real so that's why I made that track okay dope dope man well, you want to introduce the track real quick oh uh, yeah top of the real Richie Rich top of the world I felt like your back against the wall like you couldn't do nothing at all like everything was a bitch. This your Chicago. Every day, every day you hustling and trying to make a way for your family. Now you gotta pursue your dreams. No time is now. It's the chronicles in life. Richie Rich. Hey, let's get it. Hey, hey, I say now I'm on top of the world. Hey, hey, I say now I'm on top of the world. DJ Malone and Ebony Kiara. Remember what you heard it first. Shot Town Urban Radio.
I had to go back for Chicago right there for a second. There's some things that you guys probably haven't heard since we were kids. So um, that all my mama joined, that was something serious though, man. That that everybody was playing that song. It's the one and only DJ Malone. And your girl Ebony and Kiera. How's everybody doing, man? We still got Toots in the building, and I and our guy Richie Rich. Oh yeah, I'm here. How you feeling, man? I feel good. I feel you, man. So. um the Ciroc in Bel Air. Yeah, you need to get sponsored. I know, I know. I'm, I'm looking for Diddy. I owe Ciroc all of them. Call it. I'll write you the letter. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> he said, he said, I gotta get some some money. Oh yeah. Um, let me ask you this now, man. So, um, going into the future, who you like to work with? Man, you know, one of my favorite rappers. I gotta say Wayne, you know, because I know he's gonna turn that that boy crazy. You know, him or Jeezy. Okay. They're my top two I wanna work with. Okay. Uh, I wanna play a game with both of you guys. And it's called Either Or. Now dun, dun, dun. basically I give you I give you selections. Like for instance, if you if I say apples or oranges, you tell me which one you like better. So let's practice. Uh white woman or black woman? <laughs> me? Yeah. Black. Okay, there you go, and that's the game. Right. So, um, I, I, we're gonna start with this. Me white. So, what, you don't like white women or something? <laughs> no. White women no. are thick as hell, bro. They coming no. back, G. Some of them, not all. Some of. Them. I they just, thick as hell. I, black is beautiful, man. Hey, hey. hey. Bring say that, that right. On, okay. <laughs> black is beautiful. Black is beautiful. Preach. It's a beautiful thing to be black. Good. Good. So let's go ahead and, and, and talk about this. All right. So I'm going to ask both of you Tupac or Biggie? Tupac. To me, either or. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> okay. Let's go into Atlanta then. Let's go into Atlanta. T.I. Bankroll. T.I. T.I. over Bankroll. T.I. Okay. Oh, yeah, T.I. From Banky, I can't say that. Uh, no. I, I'm trying to get in trouble. Look at, look at me. Okay, let's let's. Um, <laughs> it's the old question. Hey, that? Ti Andre three thousand. Who? Ti over Andre. Over Andre. True blue through and through. Yeah, Banky, Westside. Shout out to Ti. I'm gonna have to stick with Ti. Okay. Shout out to Andre. Andre, you know he a great artist. Puppy Andre three thousand. He a great okay. artist. Let's let's go more deeper then. Let's. Still in Atlanta, T.I. Jeezy. See, now it's either or with me. You know what I'm Still T.I. with you, Tootsie? Yeah, yeah, you okay. To I got to go with either or. <laughs> okay. Let's go, <laughs> let's go or. more for, let, let's go, let's go to the East Coast then. Jay-Z, Nas. Jay-Z. Nas. Nas. Okay. Why, 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 why Jay-Z? Why Jay-Z over Nas? Because Jay-Z signed now. So obviously, and Nas was out longer. Jay Z is not just a rapper. He's a he knows he signed Nas. Yeah. yeah, he he know how to turn his his talent into an actual enterprise. It's okay, bigger than it's deeper than rap. Okay, this might be an obvious question. Remy Ma, Nikki. Remy. Nikki. Bye. Y'all <laughs> let him out. Like Why Nikki, bro? Why Nikki? Cause I mean. You know, I, I like Young Money. Shout out to Young Money. You know what I'm like saying? It. Nicki Minaj. You know, she... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> now, let's go on entrepreneurs here. Think entrepreneurs. Diddy, Birdman. Diddy. 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 All I day? That. <laughs> you know, because when once Rose dropped that joint in and it would explain how Birdman was doing all you know, yeah. his artists. You know. Diddy did the same thing. I know Diddy do the same <laughs> thing, <laughs> but like... Babble, but... Birdman, I don't know. He don't. He don't pay nobody but himself. Yeah. <laughs> okay. He didn't pay Wayne, he he pay pay Wayne and, and Wayne bad. been with him yeah. since the label was getting off the ground. Okay. Well, let's let's, let, well, let's, let's well, keep Diddy in there. Diddy, Jay Z, entrepreneurship. Diddy. Over Jay Z. I'm gonna go with Jay on entrepreneurship. Diddy I'm got more successful ventures. He got more money. I'm gonna have to go with Jay. Okay. Okay, I, I get it. I get it. Let's go. In, let's go to Chicago then. Let's go. Let's go home. Uh, Kanye or Common? Kanye. Hmm. I'm gonna have to go with Common. Okay. 
Okay. I, I respect that. I'm going to get you in trouble with this one. King Louis, Lil Dirk. That's an easy choice. Come on. I keep telling you, Dirk. So you going to pick over King Louis yes. over Westside? Yes. Huh? Oh, you going to get in like, trouble. I, <laughs> I think Dirk. You going to get in trouble. I've heard I, of Lil I, Dirk. I haven't I've heard of him. I think Dirk. Dirk. All right. See? Dirk. Who? He's from no, he's from, uh, over, over East. He, he, yeah, he's with uh, um, Bibby and them. Right. Yeah. Yeah, he's from over East. He he from West Side. Okay. okay. Must be. Too you know who sad. I really choose? <laughs> Rich. Richie Rich. Yes, that's, that's the choose. perfect answer right there. <laughs> <laughs> that's the perfect. Let's go. Let, let's do a couple more. Let's go more. You know what? Let's stay in Chicago. Um, let's see. Ebony, Eb- Eb- you got any good ones you wanna? Chicago. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, we were just talking about this. Harold's or um, Uncle Remus? He gonna watch? I already know what I, he gonna say. Uncle Remus. <laughs> I told you I'm gonna sh- shout out Uncle Remus. <laughs> you must shout be sponsored by him. Sponsored by I'm Uncle Remus. I, I, I gotta go. Yeah, I've, tried, I've tried both. I, tried I, both. I like Uncle Remus I too, but no, it, it's Harold's got it. Harold's got it. That's where I'm going. Go. go to Harold. Don't go, go to Uncle Remus. Remus. No, go to go. Uncle Remus. What did you say? Four piece dinner, mouth sauce, lemon pepper. Lemon pepper. Okay. Yeah, you lemon can't, lemon can't get mouth sauce like you can in here in Chicago. <laughs> you gotta get the mouth sauce. You gotta you get the. Mouth if sauce. you don't get the mouth sauce, it's no purpose. My mama See, that's tuned a difference. In. Mouth sauce, lemon. Harold's pepper. need lemon that's pepper. That's what you get. Four piece. Uncle, Uncle Remus don't. don't. Well, I mean, what? are they big pieces? They decent. Yeah, they decent. Atlanta start you off with six. At least the wing, the wings be this big though. Okay. Nah, guys look bigger than that. Nah, you can get I, I used to get five. Let me go more south then. <laughs> Let's do more south. Um. <laughs> Wait, Chantel said he had one. Okay. What What was your one, Chantel? Harold's or KFC? Get out of here. All right. <laughs> right. No, that. Whatever. <laughs> no. All right. So um, neither. <laughs> let's see. Let's, let's see. You know what? This is this is a funny one. Lil Uzi Vert, Lil Yachty. Oh. Oh, neither. Oh, Lil Yachty. Yachty. I respect Yachty as a businessman. His yeah. music. Yeah. Yachty's father trend. shot, shot yeah. my first video and did my first photo shoot. I'll show y'all off air because y'all going to laugh me out. But Yachty's father is that guy. Shout out Shannon McCullum. But yeah, Lil Yachty. I feel bad for him after that interview with Joe Budden. What happened? Is it no, on? It, 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 already it already aired. It already aired. Yeah. yeah. Um, it was an Breakfast interview with uh, no, the uh, complex, he did. Uh, yeah, he did. Uh, complex uh, news. Uh, you know, like, like Joe Budden did his little podcast. podcast. Thing, yeah, it was Joe Budden. And he had Lil Yachty on there, and Lil Yachty didn't know what a 360 deal was, and they clowned him. But that wasn't the main argument. I think the main argument was that. He didn't really know hip hop, and he didn't really know why he was in the game to be rapping. He only nineteen. That I'm was a part that his was in daddy the daddy is so. the guy. Look up Shannon and Cullen. His daddy is the reason he's in there. You know, his dad is that guy. And of course, I feel like Joe Budden just got mad. He ain't probably well, know man, that. I mean, he was just grilling him. He was kind of grilling him, though. I mean, I'm Joe like, Budden because he just wants to because you know off that situation of Drake. Off the situation, I think that's what he feel mad about. Who knows? Who knows? Joe Budden be angry. going off on Joe always angry. Why does my button always angry? But so I don't know. Angry. I don't know. Ever since that girl left him on one knee downtown, <laughs> 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 he ain't been the same. <laughs> okay, okay, we'll definitely <laughs> let's do one more. And this is uh, this gonna be the final one. Hmm, let me think of something real good. Something that <sighs> who's really popping right now? That's not chance to rap. That for the whole Chicago, just for real. Coke. Okay, let's do this then. Chance, Kanye. Chance, Chance. Ooh, you know he do know, more. He do more for the, for the city. I never really heard aspect. Kanye doing nothing for the city. Like, uh, but uh, talking about an aspect of putting on for the city. I like if, if you're looking here. Yeah, if, if I see it from there, but <laughs> Kanye consistently since '01 number hit. Hit, we talking about Chance right. did I'm it talking about right now. Though. Right, I'm going with Chance. I don't even think Kanye ever got a Grammy. Kanye so let's rewind it. Kanye got like 20. He got 20. Oh, okay. I was going to say. But he didn't get it independent. Right. Chance is doing everything Well, yeah. Yeah. I, I respect that. I respect so to give that. away a million dollars and you independent, that's your million dollars. Right. You know what I mean? He's really making money. That's crazy, He's though. really man. doing it. I just, I don't know. I just because maybe just because I respect Kanye from a producer standpoint, um, and how he did he did open doors. You can't say he, he did, did everything. He did. Everybody he did. dressing like Kanye right now. Every store shopping Kanye. I mean, I mean, and well, I, well, I don't know about here, but uh, yeah, my, my my whole thing. Easy. But my whole thing. Well, that was the same thing with Chief Keith. 
no matter what you want to say about Chief, oh, yeah. he did put on for his his people. He got a lot he of did. he got a yeah. lot of people into the door, yeah. like Lil Durk, um, Fredro, he did. He did. He did. and that's. You know, this is something. Y'all don't like Chief Keith. What's going on out here? It's like a whole world in Chicago. I don't know about what happened to Chief Keith. He's in jail. I think. Yeah, still. I know he's in jail, but he in jail no more. He was in jail. He was for a minute. He or he bonded out. I don't know. He think he he's for what? Nervous. Oh no, he's about to do. He's out. He's about to do Lollapalooza. He's about to do Lollapalooza. He just did. Uh, he just did that music festival that just passed. I can't think of the name of it right now. And he's on. Lala, and he's on the bill for Lollapalooza. So he's not. That's why I know Lil Durk from Chief Keith. Yeah, because because he was the one that opened the door. Chief Keith was the one. Like I, w- I would. He, here's my thing. He's the one that came with the drill sound. Well, well, um, Young Chop was the producer, but he was the one that kind of. I mean, it's always been around, but. He was the one that kind of really took it to a level of, you know, stardom with that drill music. Now, that's how um, that white guy came out with the, uh, what's that, drill time or whatever? Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. yeah. So, you know, I, I respect everybody. I just, I just don't personally think that a person like Lil Yachty, you know, I'm a, a, a commercial. He got commercial things he that has happened. He's doors t- right. And Sprite. I mean, and Sprite and he was in a target. I mean, I'm, I'm just, just saying. Maybe I'm just I'm an old head. I don't know. Maybe I'm just an old head. I'm just. Yeah. Well, yeah. I just. He's well, so like, I, I just don't like the fact that there's no lyrical stuff anymore. Well, oh, no. Nah, no, it's no, not. No, we know that. <laughs> but these kids are only tuned in for 160 characters. They can't sit and listen to a whole story. Like Jay Z meet the parents or Nas or something, they gotta hit it. And it, and it, and it, and it. Very you know yeah, because yeah. yeah. their attention span yeah. attention is just different. Now. Yeah. Well, no, no, let me ask you this then, and and we and we brought up Kendrick before. Can we now say that Kendrick is one of the greatest in that line of greatness? And I'm talking about Eminem, Pac. Can we no. now say Kendrick is in that list? Not he's not in that list, but <laughs> Rich, Rich, give it a Facebook and the Twitter every game where they can find you, man. Uh, Facebook says Rock Dows, uh, Instagram Richie the Great, uh, Snapchat Richie Rich. Richie Rich, you got a uh, back page? You ain't got no back page, no Christian me, who you know. No farmers, no nothing. What about a MySpace? Uh, huh? MySpace? I haven't had that since I was like 10. What, what about a tag? Uh, Come on. What, you got a tag? A tag? You remember a tag? Uh-uh. I got me a tag. Okay. <laughs> okay. The search will kick you out. All right. Yeah. All right, then. Well, that's what it is then, man. Uh, we're gonna come right back, man. Yo, Rich, I do appreciate you stopping by. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, let, uh, when we come back, we're gonna talk to our, our guy, CJ, and uh, we're gonna have a performance from Miss Touch in the back. Just right. in a little bit. Turn up time. Is that gonna stay around for it? Yeah.